it is time now to present the namesake of this great award, the Florida State Star, the MVP of Super Bowl XI. That was a, a couple X's ago. Member of the uh, College Fil and Pro Football Hall of Fame. Back here for the first time to present the award name for him. Folks, please welcome Mr. Fred Bolitnikoff. Good evening. It's great to be here with all these great athletes, isn't it? It's terrific. You know, through high school, college, and professional football, there have been many rewards. But to be here tonight and present an award named after you is by far the ultimate compliment. This is very exciting and very special to me. Let's take a look at this year's finalists. The nominees for the Boletnikoff Award are Michael Crabtree, Texas Tech. The strength of his hands. Big time players make big plays in big games. And that's what Michael Crabtree just did. Des Bryant, Oklahoma State. No ball is uncatchable for this Cowboy superstar. This Texas native is a threat to take it to the house on every play. Jeremy Macklin, Missouri. One of the best athletes in the country. Macklin helped the Tigers capture the Big 12 North title for the second consecutive season. On behalf of the Boletnikoff family, the Tallahassee Quarterback Club Foundation, and our selection committee, we want to congratulate, for the second year in a row, Michael Crabtree from Texas Tech. Michael Crabtree is the first two-time winner of the Boletnikoff Award. That's a nice hug from receivers there, Fred, congratulations. And and, sir, you win it as a freshman. You, you, you come back here as a sophomore. I mean, it, it's got to be humbling. You now have to be considered, you know, one of the most accomplished wide receivers in college football history. Uh, I would say it's a true blessing, man. I got to thank God with that one now. And I gotta, um, can't leave out my, my quarterback in Graham Harrell. Uh, Mr. Harrell's over there. Uh, so many hookups. I mean, I was on the sidelines. You got beat Texas, one of the, one of the plays of the year that kind of shaped the championship chase. Sorry, Colt, to bring up that memory, but that's one of those plays that's going to live forever in history. Did you have that sense when you crossed the goal line that it was going to be that kind of moment? Uh, I, didn't, I didn't know what to expect, but um, the only, only part I remember about that is um, you on the sideline with uh. your mouth wide open, man. <laughs> that was pretty cool. Yeah. You can't help a guy for getting excited. That was pretty exciting. You guys were so excellent and, and so strong for 11 games. How do you come to terms with, to a lot of people, the one game that you did lose overshadows all that? It, it can't be easy. Overall, excellent season, but there was that one game. Uh, it, was, it's a, it was a great year to be a Ray Raider. Um, I feel like we had fun, and, um, you know, that's, that's what all counts. You know, as long as you have fun and uh, everything else will, uh, you know, go for itself. So I had fun this year. And, uh, man, you, you can ask Graham himself, man. We both, uh, we, we dreamed this uh, in the summer. And, uh, it came down to one, one, uh, one game, so I mean, uh, we're going to take it like it is and um, look forward to the next game. It, it looked like fun in Lubbock the weekend we were there. It's got to be fun playing for Coach Leach, except for those practices I saw of her. Michael, congratulations. Back-to-back -back winner of the Bolitnikoff Award.